down a long winding road off of Interstate 64 in West Virginia in Talcott, very small town by the Greenbrier River, is the John Henry Historical Site. The legend of John Henry was born in the Summers County community known as Talcott. It was known and verified that he was a steel driver who helped drill a hole through the Great Bend Tunnel through the Big Bend Mountain for the Chesapeake and Ohio Railroad around 1870. When a steam drill showed up that the company wanted to use to bore through the mountains instead of the men, they were obviously nervous and upset because this was their livelihood. So as the story goes, and there are witnesses, that John Henry worked in a contest with the steam drill and he beat it. And the reason that he beat it was because the steam drill, when it would get the shale from the mountain, it would clog. So every time it clogged, they had to clean it, and John Henry kept working. He was an African-American, possibly a freed slave from either Virginia or North Carolina. It was said that he was between 30 and 35 years old and weighed around 200 pounds, with huge muscles, as a life of hard work would give you. He was said that he was a good man and a trustworthy one and he was well respected in the community. Songs like the John Henry songs, different versions of them, were sung during the work day to help the men keep pace and help to keep their mind off their work. So it was only fitting that after John Henry died, there would be a song about him. Some say that they don't believe that he died right after he beat the steam drill, as the story says, but that he did die a short while later, maybe from a fall or a landslide in the tunnel. And there is written evidence that he would, was buried near the Greenbrier River. He's a true American folk hero, is of a man who stood up for his convictions against technological advancement that would have, and eventually did to this day, reduce the number of workers required to perform jobs in all fields. These are the people that share the traits and convictions of John Henry. These are the people of forgotten America. Thank you.